Welcome back to The Globe on SABC News. As political tensions seem to have subsided, Zimbabwe's premier tourism showcase, the Sanganai Hlangana World Tourism and Travel Expo got underway today in Bulawayo. South Africa will be participating for the second time in a row. A total of 325 companies are participating, 74, 77 of which are foreign participants, with South Africa having the largest contingent with 25 exhibitors. Zimbabwe's tourism sector is experiencing a boom with the country's prime destination, Victoria Falls, currently experiencing 100% hotel occupancy. This is the first Sanganai we are holding under this new dispensation. We are happy that we are holding this Sanganai under this new dispensation when overnight the image of the country has changed. The image of the country has completely changed. The markets are now at least listening to us they are now at least looking forward to talking to us. They are coming here, trying to look at our products, trying to package our products for them to go back to the markets and sell our products. Some come even uninvited. They are coming on their own. They are looking and they are talking to the industry. Revenue has also improved. When we look at uh, the figures uh, in terms of the first half of the year, I want to say from January to June, over 500 million, close to 600 million has been realized. And by the end of the day, I think by the end of the year, we should do close the year at over a billion. Yet last year, we closed the year at 819 million. When you look on, on, on the overall tourism, uh, we, are, we have reached already 1.6 billion uh, travelers. One of the biggest markets in the meantime is, 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 is China with 1. 120 million outbound travelers. So the world is traveling and the world is looking for destinations. And we have to keep in mind that Zimbabwe once was a destination. Then unfortunately something happened that brought you under a, a wrong light, so to say. So the perception of Zimbabwe was, shall we really go there? The country's vice president, Constantino Chiwenga, is expected to officially open the travel expo. Sophie Mugwen, SABC News.